So, hey guys, Scripps Guy here. How you doing? Love you. Um, guys, I just wanted to talk about this coronavirus thing, um, and how uh, it came about, where it's put a lot of fear, as you guys know, in society, in families, uh, basically disrupting the whole market, the world. Um, <clears throat> just, uh, it's a virus, you know, kind of like the swine flu, but, uh, possibly manufactured by man. Um, it's kind of a serious thing. So, but, so there's a lot of fear in the air and, uh, I don't know what to say guys about what I'm looking at here, but, uh, um, what possesses somebody to sell all your Bitcoin, sell all your, all your crypto, sell all your, your stocks to uh, hurry up and uh, buy toilet paper. I mean, if I thought I was uh, going to need to prepare for something like a pandemic, uh, it wouldn't be, you know, buying the store out their toilet paper, you know, or, <laughs> I mean, I'd be buying, you know, rice, something that will last for eight years, you know, or uh, dried beans or something like that, or, you know, hey, water, why not? I mean, water's a, uh, you don't want to, you know, you can't live without water. But I mean, toilet paper, I mean, really, is that the, is that what you need to do is just go out there and buy all the toilet paper you, you can get, what, you can't wash your butt? I mean, I don't, I just don't understand uh, how the masses get scared uh, <laughs> to, to, to hurry up and run out and buy some uh, paper for your butt, but I'm just uh, totally blown away about it. I mean, I guess nothing surprises uh, me anymore now these days, I mean, uh, <laughs> but it just goes to show how stupid we really are i mean as as a human race i mean um i mean just that's just the facts uh some people do some stupid things and then one person uh buys uh you know 12 years worth of toilet paper and then the whole you know continent of australia needed to go ape crazy on buying paper uh for their butt um, and then mass hysteria for more toilet paper. And it's just absolutely insane. But that's the kind of world we live in, guys. So, I mean, <laughs> I mean, if this is the kind of fear uh, you're going through, which I hope it's not. Um, I hope you're a little bit more responsible uh, about what's going on. I mean, I... <laughs> I mean, I saw online that someone was selling uh, eight ounces of sanitizer for fifty dollars, and someone's stupid enough to buy that stuff. But again, that's the kind of world we live in. But this is going to be a Digibyte video, uh, a short one, guys. Uh, uh, as you know, Bitcoin has pulled back majorly. We we see a little, uh, you know, support. Um, <laughs> around 5,000, uh, but it could go lower, but what that means is, um, it's going to affect, uh, the fundamentals, uh, I mean, as someone, as people use it, mine it, um, these things, uh, are going to be affected, and it's going to be unprofitable for, uh, miners that, um, have, uh, really expensive machines, you know, that aren't mining, because the price is uh, down, not mining in probability because the prices are down because they don't have adequate um, energy saving equipment, um, you know, cheap electricity. Uh, So that's uh, Bitcoin's problem right now. But Digibyte, on the other hand, I don't care how low it is, guys. uh, Digibyte is going to thrive. Um you know, regardless if, uh, you know, the masses aren't using Digibyte, uh, Digibyte doesn't come into that problem, um, where, uh, speed's an issue, the network crashing, um, as far as I can tell, it hasn't affected, 
the Digi by blockchain, this fear and uh, low cap and and this uh, crash that we've been experiencing. Uh, so uh, I have no fear in that, and I have uh, optimistic uh, views about Digi by anyway, and. It's just one of those things where uh, Digibyte is truly decentralized, and um, guys, Digibyte is getting pushed down. Um, <laughs> and you know, I haven't sold, guys. I'm hanging in there, and yeah, I lost some money. I lost, you know, hey, thousands of dollars. I mean, I, you know, you're not supposed to be getting in this market um, and spend more or all your uh life savings you know more than you can afford to lose um but no i'm buying man i i've been buying digibyte um you know i'm trying to get on more exchanges so i can uh flash uh buy my digibyte so that's where i stand and um you know uh, and and for people that are scared in life and you know, uh, I just, I'm just going to be bold here and you have fears in life that, uh, fears of this world and, um, you're not sure, uh, what's going on and, uh, you know, your emotions are driving you in a downward spiral. Um, I'm just going to say it. If you don't know Jesus Christ as your personal Lord and Savior, um, there is an, <laughs> there is a destination for those that are lost um, but uh the key word there is uh, lost souls that you know that need to be found by the lord jesus christ who paid for your sins on the cross you got to make that thing personal because if you don't make the death of god on the cross personal that paid your debt so you can be free and clear and if you don't trust and uh in his death burial and resurrection um I'm sorry guys I, I don't know what to say I'm going to try to say it nicely but truthfully there's hell to pay and this world is going hell in a handbasket really quick um, but yeah I mean uh, just trust in a God that is willing to forgive all your sins just wash it all away um, that's why I, that's why I don't fear I don't fear anything that man can do to me I, I fear him who can destroy both body and soul and that's uh god so uh, uh yeah your your soul is eternal and and uh you know there <laughs> god created something eternal which we are and there's a a destination for that eternal soul in the afterlife and that would be either hell or or eternal uh everlasting life with uh, jesus christ our lord so there i said it um anyway it, there's nothing to be afraid of guys uh so i mean you don't have to run out uh, two o'clock in the morning and buy toilet paper but like i said i'm buying i'm buying while there's fear and blood on the streets all right guys scripts got it out mm -hmm.